Hey there, fabulous people. How are you doing? It is Master Rolf here. Welcome to another Your Army episode here in Clash of Clans. Today is a huge episode. We got loads to go through. We've got awesome raids and we could upgrade our town hall today, which is going to be absolutely awesome. So before I go through that, guys, you'll probably notice there was no intro to this video. There was none of that whatever it is. I don't know how it goes. Tell me below in the comments either intro if you want the intro or no intro if you don't want that little intro, you know, that kind of flashes up and makes you all hyper and stuff. Um, so, yeah, tell me if you want that or not and then I can continue doing it because I don't know whether to put it on or not. Uh, and I'd love you guys to tell me. So, enough about that. Let's get straight on into the action. Welcome to the base. As you can see, we have got a ton of loot because I've done a ton of raiding. Look at these recent... All right, forget the defenses. The, the, they don't count. They're absolutely awful. Have a look at this bad boy. Yeah, look at those attacks. We've got a lot of loot. We only lost one of them as well. Uh, and I can show you those. But also... We've got enough to upgrade this baby. Now, everything in my, uh, in my clan, in my world, I don't even know what's called it, in my base, uh, that's the word, is, I believe, uh, max level. Except for this clan castle, which we're gonna try and upgrade today as well. Uh, my clan castle's not upgraded. Uh, I don't know if these bombs are, actually. Yeah, the bombs are. Uh, the walls aren't, but obviously I can do the walls while my town hall is upgrading, which gives me perfect time. So if you guys can see anything that needs upgrading here, tell me in the comment section below. Uh, some people said the mortars in the last episode, but actually they aren't. They are max level for uh, my town hall. So yeah, they're pretty cool. Which means in this fabulous episode, everybody, we can click this upgrade button and we can wait six days. That is right. We have six days to upgrade my walls now uh, and we can upgrade this. And look at all this fancy new stuff we get, including the king and the dark elixir, which is like the most pinnacle thing about this is we get dark elixir and we get the dark barracks. So I'm really excited. Let's do this. Yeah, baby. Six days to go. Wow, it's like Christmas all over again. We could gem it, but I'm not going to because this is a no-gem account. I'm not going to lie. I've had actually a lot more fun on this account since I don't gem it compared to the other one. I mean, I love the, the gem to max account, but this one's really, really fun. And uh, yeah, it's a completely different way to play, and I really enjoy it. Anyway, we are now going to go out and raid. Uh, we've got a few replays to show you, but before we show you those replays, we'll go and do a live raid because we're going to try and get enough money to upgrade this bad boy right here. Uh, we need 800,000. We have 700,000. So maybe one or two raids uh, and we should be able to do it. So let's go straight into the battle and see what we can find. So we want to find anything with 100,000 loot. That's kind of what I... Oh, there we go. That is exactly what I'm going for. Uh, 100,000 loot is pretty much perfect for me at the moment. So this base is... Beautiful. I'm going to take this base and I'm going to take this guy's loot. Thank you, Clash of Clans. Uh, Chief, remember the one gem boost event is will be disabled tomorrow. Well, that's why I follow them and that's why I make sure their notifications come up. Also, that kind of helped you guys uh, as well in this video. That uh, Just to remind you that the boost does end tomorrow. So let's attack this base. Giants go in first, followed by Barbarians, followed by Archers. You know how to do it. Uh, I don't need to tell you guys. And we're throwing our clan castle troops as well. We also have war today, everybody. And I am going to be showing you live raids. I'm sadly not in the war because I'm really low down in this clan. Um, but I will be showing you the live raids, which is going to be really exciting. And we're going to watch it from the start. So as soon as that war starts, we'll be watching it. And that's going to be really exciting. So there we go. We've taken the 100,000 worth of loot in gold. Very, very easy. Very, very nice. Uh, we're going to get that 50%, and we're also going to take out that town hall too, so this is not a problem for us. Look at those giants going in there with utter swag. We've got minions rocking around as well uh, from our clan castle. We've got archers and everything, and now we're taking this elixir. We're going to three-star this base. Wow, what a start to the episode. A three-star and a lot of loot. Oh, we also have one thing left to upgrade in our research lab in our laboratory, so we're going to go do that as well because we need to make sure we upgrade everything. But before we do that, let's just get this three star. Let's get this under wraps. Look at the giants going in and their total destruction. Oh man, he's got one builder hut. He's got one builder hut. So here it goes. The epic race of epicness. Dun -dun 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 the archers have got this. What? Look at the archers. They're so fast. These guys uh, really don't understand. Uh, neither does this one girl. That one girl that's like, what's going on? Uh, but luckily, the barbarian gets there first. He must have done some kind of trick shot to get there. But we get 100,000 gold, which means we can upgrade our clan castle. I'm not going to upgrade it just yet. Just in case I can't find a base and I run out of gold while I'm searching for bases. But we can obviously go into our research lab and upgrade the final thing, which is this. Uh, I do believe we can... Up oh, no, we can't upgrade our research lab either. Our laboratory. So that's fine. 
Anyway, let us uh, get our troops ready to rumble again. So we need to wait for them to get ready. While we wait for them to get ready, I can show you guys these three raids. Yeah, these are three. That's a bad raid. Look at that raid there. I was like, these balloons are going to destroy this base. I did this a couple of days ago, and they, they did not destroy the base. Anyway, let's have a look at this. So this is a big loot mama. And this one was quite nice because most of the... Look at the giant when he spawned them in. Look how weird he looks. Most of the loot is in these collectors right here. So that's why I spawned up the giants around the collectors. Uh, but he also had quite a bit of loot in his gold storage. So I wanted to be able to tickle that gold storage and just, just get a little bit of that gold storage. Uh, but as you can see, spawning in two giants accompanied by archers and barbarians all around the base uh, to make sure we get those collectors. That is what we do, baby. And uh, you'll see his loot is dropping into my pockets. 100,000 already taken, another 100,000 to take. Uh, the elixir was actually kind of spread between his pumps and his actual uh, elixir storage. So I had to be careful about that because I didn't want to waste a load of troops because... This guy's got an alright defense. I mean, it's nothing amazing. Don't We probably could have restarted, but I didn't want to waste my troops on it. Uh, so I didn't use all my troops. And I didn't think I used my lightning or heal spell. No, I don't think I used those. Uh, so that was pretty good as well. But you can see here, I spawned in some wizards uh, along with that giant. So they at least start going for those gold storages. Because there's 64,000 in those storages. Um, and luckily, as you can see, they actually do take them down. And we get the loot from them, which is amazing. We literally had such a good load of raids this morning. This morning has been amazing. I haven't been on this account for a while. Uh, and uh, the, the loot... Well, I, at least I haven't been raiding on it. But now the loot is, some for some reason, absolutely fantastic. So again, we've got full army camps. Uh, let us go and do another raid. Ah, stop that. No, go back. Please don't get... Okay, we're fine. I'm going to ask my clan quickly for troops before we go. Uh, hashtag winning! Hashtag winning is what we need. Uh, but before we do that, I need to show you another raid. Otherwise, we'll lose raids. Uh, so let's have a look at this one. Again, this one was very, very nice to me indeed. All of the gold was at the top of that base. That is a bad thing to do. Don't put all your gold at the top of the base in the collectors like that. Uh, so we were able to just swarm it with barbarians and archers. In they go. You can also tell my cold's getting a little bit better, which is really nice. I forgot, I forgot, I forgot about that until this episode. I haven't been like... So we're okay. Uh, but in go the barbarians, in go the archers, taking all that loot, and there we go, we've taken the loot, we've not even touched the inside of his base, uh, so when we do get in there, we're pretty close to getting that 50% already, which is very nice for us, uh, but we're on 40% now, pushing in, trying to get a little bit more loot, some of the archers at the top have gone in, I spawned a few around the outside just to take out these annoying buildings, uh, we can speed this up because it's not really important. But there we go, we get the 50%, we take all of his loot, we run home with the money, we got the golden ticket, and that was absolutely lovely. So, let us go now, and if we got troops, there we go, is it full? It is full. Uh, thank you. We can now go and do another fantastic live raid, and then we can upgrade our final thing that I think we have to upgrade, which is the clan castle. Which is very, very important. Literally, as soon as you can get your clan castle, please get it, because it is so, so important. People completely underestimate how important the clan castle is on defense and attack. Um, we're not going to find any good raids now. What is going on? Give me a good raid. Give me the money. Come on, 100k. We're getting like 5k's. 60k. Uh, not really worth our time. Oh, Clash Gods. What are you doing? Why, why, why you not give us the big loot? There we go. That is what we're all about. Thank you. And look at that. He's put them all there for us. What a absolute gentleman. App, Appicon. Thank you. Uh, so I'm going to spawn in one giant just for lols. Uh, and then we're going to throw in our barbarians all the way around there. Throw in our archers all the way around that. And we're going to take that loot. And we're literally just going to run home super, super happy. Uh, so he's also got some in his storages over here. Let's take those down. And I don't think there's anything in there. But we'll start sniping it. Look at the money. The money is coming into our hands, everybody. It is absolutely delicious. It's delicious. It's absolutely delicious. Um, should we three-star this base as well? Should we give it a go? Let's give it a go. Why not? Uh, we're going to just go for it and let's see if we can three-star it. We probably won't be able to, uh, considering actually that's quite hard to three-star because of his stuff. But we'll give it a go. He's got quite high-level stuff here. Uh, but I'm going to put a heal spell. I'm literally going all out now on this. Uh, try to take this base down. Let's go! I was going to be nice to you, but now I am not. I'm going to waste my spells on you. And we're going to take you down. Yes, we got the 50%. We would go from a calm attack of just, like, getting his loot now to trying to completely destroy his base. And that is exactly what we're doing. Look at them. Look at the archers go. No, not a bomb. Ooh, that bomb did damage. 
Uh, but anyway, we've got our troops going into the center. We've taken down the town hall. We just have a couple of things remaining. If there's giant bombs there, though. No! Oh, no! No, we're not going to do it! Yes, we did it. We did it. We were okay. I thought they were going to all get killed by that. But luckily, we're fine. Uh, and they were able to take that final bit. Thank you, Apcon. I was going to be nice and not take everything and kind of leave you with your base. But I thought I'd take it all down. So that works very, very well indeed. So I think... That is everything we need to do now. I can obviously upgrade this. Shabong. There we go. We have like so little loot now. It's so depressing. Uh, but we should be absolutely fine. And that is absolutely everything done. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Don't forget, later today there will be another episode on this account looking at this clan war. Ovid War versus Onon. Ono? Ono. I'm not sure. Uh, which is going to be really, really exciting. Because if we have a look at the clans, uh, you can see that we have a, a really high levels in my clan. Uh, like, ridiculously high levels. And then we have me at the bottom, like, hello. Uh, actually, where am I? Where am I? I don't even know where I am in this. Uh, but then, oh no, of course I'm not, because it's an enemy clan. But the enemy clan as well is also very high level. So it's going to be very interesting. This is a foreign clan. I have no idea what all that writing on the wall is that they're trying to say. But it is going to be very exciting indeed. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Tell me down below whether you like the intro at the beginning or whether you don't like the intro at the beginning and you want it just to be like straight into the video like it was today. And until next time, friends, thank you so much for watching. Peace out.